we're gonna get ready for our um, cabbage steak cabbage steaks I know you have heard about cabbage steaks well this is another way to eat healthy and I'm gonna line it with some parchment paper and once I line it then I've got my cabbage I'm gonna show you how I cut it you cook it out you cook it on about 400 as well I like the parchment papers that's already pre uh, pre-cut makes it easier but that's okay we'll deal with this we're gonna be making cabbage steaks so I've got my cabbage I'm gonna wash it off make sure you get it nice and clean and any extra like these leaves are tight but this core right here you just want to cut it off you don't want that to be there what you're going to do is you're going to take this little piece right here this core you don't want to dig it out because you need it to stay together for the cabbage so we're going to cut that piece out see and it's not all gone and then that just allows you to flatten it down. And then the ends that won't lay flat, you just want to cut just this little end off right there on both sides. Get rid of those. You don't need those. This is another healthy dish. You're going to cook these for like 30 minutes. And then what you do is, before the 30 minutes, 10 minutes in, you're going to then add your cheese. Okay? So, we've got our parchment paper here. I will spray it with some avocado oil. So, I'm going to spray it. And then what we're gonna do is these little extra little leaves, we're gonna take these off. We don't need these. Get rid of that. Get rid of this. Okay. Then about an inch thick. You want them to be about an inch thick. So you're gonna slice it. Here's one. Next one. If the leaves if the leaves come loose, that's fine. Take them. You could either leave them on there, or you can take them off. I'm gonna take them off. This is a real good meal. That's all you have to do now. Just add you some meat. You'll be good to go. And then I think I can get two out of here. Don't need that. Any extra leaf that, see that core helps hold it together. Look at that. Looks real good. So I really got about, okay. So I got a little one. Okay. Here's our cabbage steaks. I'm going to turn, push this up, push that up. And then see, here they are. These are cabbage steaks. And then we're going to line them with uh, some not line them but we're going to cover them with um, some salt pepper and some olive oil olive oil and then once we, um, we get our olive oil on there I gotta fill my jar back my thing back up 
Make sure you get them so they'll cook really good. We've got our salt and pepper. Easy, I use kosher salt. Easy on the salt, you don't need that much. Then we got our pepper. This is gonna be good. And then we're gonna add some oregano. Oregano leaves, gives it a different taste. And then these are ready for the oven. Here are the cabbage steaks that are seasoned. They're going in the oven at 350 degrees for 30 minutes. Okay guys, here are the cabbage steaks. They are ready to go. Look how that cheese just melted on top and see how on the edges of the cabbage, how they are really charred. This really looks good. We are gonna eat good this week. Cause I'm not cooking no more this week. <laughs> I've done plenty. So again, this is cabbage. These are cabbage steaks. I had one head of cabbage and then you cut them thick. You don't cut the core out. You just cut it off on the end. Lay the cabbage down and you'll see how I prepared this dish. Peace.